It's her! Yep, you definitely missed me. Hello guys, how's it going? My name is Johnny Toby. Welcome back to the Star Wars Force Arena. And today we're going to be playing a Vader deck. And this deck actually I used to play it before the global release. So it's like a classic deck, <laughs> if you say so. And yeah, the, the thing with this deck is it's really strong. Because if you manage to get the ACSD, you know, to target the tower with health. And then you go to the tower and try to suicide with it. Even if you die, your troops get, you know, because of the passive of Vader, they regain health. So that's very good. And I remember this 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 was the death that got me to to Kyber before the global release. So yeah, I'm just going to be playing with it in a, in two matches. I remember that I would record this video on my work, so I'm just going to try to do the commentary over because I really don't remember the game. <laughs> I play so many games every day, so yeah, let's see what, what is waiting in there. Okay, I dropped the walker down there. I think it was because I didn't have anything else that I wanted to, you know, to deploy, so. Oh, so I, I going very aggressive here. Okay. Wow. I'm going very aggressive at this push. As you can see, I kill him and my troops get, you know, health. And that's very good if you manage to know where and when, you know, to... Where you can put your troops so they stay alive and then trying to kill the enemy leader to gain that uh, health and bandits. So, yeah, I'm in trouble here. He's going to. Uh, no, he's not going to kill me. Okay. So the tank is. Okay, the tank is not on my tower. That's okay. Wow, his, those are the pushes guys that, that always win to me when they drop, you know, a tank and then they respawn and drop another tank because they already cycle to it and in that death, you know, death spawn, they get energy, you know, and then they drop the tank again I'm, and I'm just recovering from my, <laughs> from the last push. That's insane. The, I'm thinking that the death timer should be tweaked a little bit because I have killed like eight times a leader in a match and they still won over me just because they're they're high level guy. But I don't know because it, you know if I die a lot too, then that's going to hurt the game a lot for me. So I don't know if that is a, even a good idea. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm just... Maybe that walker was a bad idea after all. I don't know if he's going to... Yeah, he's going to... Oh boy, I'm in trouble here. So I need to drop a walker. See guys, as you can see, in my dead timer, I, I was managed to recover energy to drop another walker, so that's going to be gain here. Wow, I will have been so pissed. <laughs> Sorry, man. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of people using uh, Vader in the top rank, so I may as well start playing with him. But I really want, you know, having to level 3, and I just want more away from that. Okay. Seems that I'm trying to change something. I, I think I, I don't, but. Well, yeah, guys, let me know in the comments if you have problems with Vader. 
you know i i know that in 2v2 he's like one of the most op leaders if you say if you say it like that because he's really good and if you have him in level three or level four he's godly when he you know when he's attacking the the turrets because he's very tanky so yeah Wow, I'm playing again Han Solo here. Okay. So, <laughs> he dropped the... Man, those Grenadiers are insane. I face off a, a, a Lando guy and with the cycle, he managed to deploy like three Grenadiers in the back of the turrets. <laughs> That was just insane because all my troops die and I, I even died too. Okay. I don't know what. Oh, my tour is very low. Wow. Okay, okay. I'm going to make the strong push here. So I stunned the, the jetty. So the. Okay, I'm going to take out the tower. Nice. That was actually a, a very good placement for me. Because I stunned the, not the leader, but the, the Jedi, the Gigorian Rebel, to to let my my HTSD, you know, to uh, take out the tower. Here's another Chewy. Oh, the, the. I thought that my blazeman would not, you know, hit Chewy. Okay. That guy <laughs> has to be very, <laughs> very mad right now. Okay, so, it, yeah. He has to be very mad right now because he knows his. If he doesn't stop the, the the walkers push, that's going to be game for him. So I hope he doesn't. Yeah, no. Oh, but he plays a a jetty on that side, and that's going to take out my yeah. Wow, a level four car can't just annihilate a level 7 car, you know. Those Gigorian Rebels are very good. <laughs> I guess the HTST probably the best counter for them right now. Because I, I don't know if the turrets is still, you know, viable for people. If people still use them, because I I know that in 2v2 they use the, the turret, and even the mortar, but... I don't know if 1v1 there is a point to bring the turret. Yeah guys, it was a good game. And I'm gonna be posting a Leia deck later too. A free to play Leia deck, so stay tuned for that, subscribe and like this video. And I will see you guys on the next video. Nice.